let's take ourselves to Wind Park in Belfast and a welcome for William Wilkinson. Here he is. <laughs> William, you're most welcome. You're most welcome. Over here now, now, William, you were on a, an Ulster bus tour, is That's what right. has you here. Where yeah. were you, sir? Down around Cork, Larney and Coldfield and places like that. Was it your first time over? Or in, no, in I've been around Connemara and Donegal and that, you know. You like it, you do? Yeah. Nice yeah. countries. And who did yeah. you bring with you on this trip that you were on? My wife, just my wife and myself. Just the wife you brought her. And what's her name? Mary. Mary. Now, you've, you've uh, children as well. You've two sons, yes. isn't that right? What are their names? Hugh and Mark. Hugh and Mark. And you were watching last Saturday? I was. Where were you? Were you, were you at home watching it? In the home. Yeah. Oh, you have the good reception, have you, where yeah. you were? Good man. Yeah. Delighted, delighted your part. So, did you get a fright? I did. Poor LK was gobsmacked. What happened <laughs> to you? <laughs> <laughs> My name was last night, and I, you know. Did you get a bit of a, a bit of a jolt? A Scare, like. Yeah, yeah, I bet you did. Well, listen, have you any plans if you want a, a, a good few bob? Any thoughts? Anything you'd like to do that you I mightn't have done up to not now? Really, I haven't decided it. You know? Have you not? No. And have you hobbies, interests, things you like? Country music and better gardening and stuff like that. Country music? Yeah. So you buy loads of CDs, would you? Yeah. And where would you like to go to America? Maybe you go to uh, Nashville? One yeah, these what? Yeah. Would you? Do you sing at all? No, I do not. Oh, thank God for that. <laughs> <laughs> for a moment there, I thought we were going to have a quick sing song on one of these things. <laughs> Listen, uh, you've, you've a, a dog, I believe. That's right. Called? Judy. Is Judy watching at the moment? No, she's in the kennel. Oh, she's in the kennel, right. right. And you've a, you've a cat as well? Yeah. And what's the cat's name? Echo. Echo? Yeah. And does Judy hit Echo at all? No. So there's no, no violence at all? No, no. No, so they're quite they're good pals, yeah, are they? Yeah. And, and if anybody did to hit Echo, you'd just say, what's that? That's nothing, it's just an Echo. I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> but you've, you've no trouble at all, really, with the animals no, at all. No. No. So where, if we were able to send you on a holiday anywhere in the world in this particular show, where would you, where would you like to go in the world? I'd like to go to New York. New York? Yeah. And would, you, would the two of you go, or would you go on your own? No, the two of us would go. Oh, good man, because wouldn't, you wouldn't want to go on your own there. No, no you'd be better <laughs> off to go. Listen, you had people you wanted to say hello to at home. Yes. Where, who did you want to say hello to? All, the, all the people in Belfast. Hello. Just the people of Belfast? Yes. It's a bit of a wide-ranging thing. <laughs> Good man, William. Well, listen, we wish all the people of Belfast well. We're delighted you're with us, my Thank friend, you. and I wish you the best tonight. Thank you. Give William a welcome. There he goes. <laughs> That's our five players for Fame and Fortune right now. We're ready to play Fame and Fortune. Let's play now. <laughs> now. Our brand new opening game is the Zodiac game. A potential here exists to win holidays, of course, and up to £24,000 for each of our players. Three star signs revealed. They choose whatever they happen to be. Those uh, values range one, two, three, and £4,000, and they can alter. Everybody could pick the same star signs. It wouldn't make any odds. Uh, they could all be the same. They could be different, whatever. But it's a bit of gambling going on here. Kay, you all right for a bit of gambling? I am. Good girl yourself. All right, Kay, pick three star signs for me, please. Uh, Cancer, Capricorn, and Scorpio. Cancer, Capricorn, and Scorpio. All right, now that's your three. Are they picked for your three children or for any reason at all? Uh, well, two of them had, yeah, three of them had birthdays within those months. Oh, good. All right, so there's a reason in the back of your mind for doing yeah. it. All right. Well, now I wish you the best of luck, Kay. Let's see how we do. Here's your three Capricorn, Scorpio, and Cancer. Which one do you want to go with first? Scorpio. Scorpio. £4,000, Kay. £4,000. That's it. Now, Cancer. Or Capricorn? Um, cancer. Cancer. And £3,000. It's £7,000. <laughs> now, you have a decision to make here, Kay. You have £7,000. If you go for Capricorn... Now, you can stop and keep that seven, and that's fine. But if you go for Capricorn, you want it to be a one or you want it to be a two. That's your gamble, because what you're risking is the three. You'll keep the four one way or the other. If you stop now, you have seven, you don't have to do anything. Do you want to risk it to try and get another one or £2,000 up there? No, I'll stick. you stick, Kay. Yeah. A wise move, perhaps. A wise move. But... Let's see what it might have been. Let's see what it might have been behind Capricorn. It would have been a holiday. No holiday, Kay. No holiday. It doesn't matter. What would the money have been, of course? We need to know that as well. It would have been two, and you would have got that as well. It's gone, it doesn't matter. £7,000 so far. Give Kay a round of applause. Well done. Doesn't matter. No, no. That's fine. These things sometimes work to your advantage. You're better, better to sit pretty on it. You have a good amount of money. Lavinia, your turn. Which three? Cancer, Pisces and Virgo. Cancer, Pisces and Virgo. Now, would you start sending people in the old job or the new job? <laughs> family. Family. All good for you. Stick with the family. All right, now we have our three coming up. You can see the way it works. Sometimes the risk pays off, sometimes it doesn't. But 
Here's your three. Pisces, Virgo, Cancer. Which one? Um, cancer and Pisces. Well, Cancer yes. to start. Mm. £4,000 a million. <laughs> you want to go Pisces? <laughs> you do? Look at Pisces. All right, Pisces second. And £1,000, it's £5,000. <laughs> now, same argument. <laughs> You have five, you can stop now and you have five thousand pounds. Okay? okay yeah. Loads of health insurance available to you now, Lavinia. <laughs> yeah. With that company, can't remember the name of them now. Um, five thousand pounds you have. However, if you risk it to go with Virgo, you're risking it to try and make a two or a three. Okay. If you get a one or a four, you will get the maximum that you see up there, single amount, which is four. So you're risking mm -hmm. losing one, mm -hmm. but you might make two and you might make three. Okay. I have a look at Virgo. You'll have a look at Virgo. Well, if, yeah, but if you're going, you're going. <laughs> and it's three. Well done. Eight thousand pounds. Good start. Eight thousand. All right. Now, Ollie. Ollie, your turn now. Have a look at the three. At all the star signs. Uh, <clears throat> Scorpio. Scorpio. Aquarius. Aquarius. Yep. Yes. And cancer. And Cancer. Scorpio, Aquarius, and Cancer. <laughs> Ali, I think you're young enough to go to the grad. I don't know why you won't go. Don't Would you not pop in for half an hour? I doubt it. I wouldn't be late, I'd say. Are you, are you, are you, well, you would, I wouldn't go on my own. I'd bring... No. no. But make sure Margaret was beside me. Now, Aquarius, Cancer and Scorpio. Which one? Scorpio. Scorpio. And a holiday is yours. Let's see where it is. Your prize is a three-day break for two people to the fascinating city of Salzburg with flight and accommodation paid to the value of £1,200. Nice one. It's only a hop, skip and a jump to Jamaica, that's, Ali. That's nice. Let's have a look at the money behind it. £2,000 as well. <laughs> now, Aquarius or Cancer? Uh, Aquarius. Aquarius. Another holiday. <laughs> Another holiday. <laughs> See the sights. Take in a show, because your prize is a weekend for two people in London to the value of £800. <laughs> And more money, and more money. One thousand pounds. You've now got three thousand pounds. Now the decision you have to make here is, you know, you have the holidays, and they're guaranteed. Nothing's going to happen to those. You have your two trips guaranteed. You have, if you stop now, three thousand pounds. But if you want to find out what cancer has to hold, you're looking for three thousand or four thousand in there. If it's a one or a two, you lose the one and you, you'll end up with 2,000 pounds. So there's your risk factor. Do you want to go for it? Yes. Or... I'll risk it, I'll risk it, yeah. You risk it, Ollie? I'll risk it. All right, Ollie, all right. 3,000 pounds, 6,000 pounds you have. Well done. Two holidays and 6,000 pounds, Ollie. That's, that's, a hell of a, that's a hell of a goal. Well done. Now, William, your turn. Let's have a look at the board. Which three would you like? Pisces. Pisces? Uh, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. And cancer. And Cancer. Pisces, Sagittarius, and Cancer. You might get a holiday yet. I think, I think Ollie's left a few, William. I don't know how many, but there should be a few left. Now, Sagittarius, Cancer, or Pisces? Off you go. Cancer. Cancer. £2,000 is yours. <laughs> Pisces or Sagittarius? Sagittarius. Sagittarius. And £3,000, £5,000. <laughs> you can stop now, William. You can stick with that and say, I have £5,000, I'm a happy man. Or you can risk it and go with Pisces to see if you can get one or four. If you get a two or a three when you go to Pisces, you will be reduced to the biggest single amount there, which is £3,000. Mm. So the chances... We don't know what they are, but it's really up to you to decide if you want to risk two to make, I know, four, but maybe just to make one. You must decide. Uh, stick. Yeah, stick? Yeah. One man, William. There's a cat and a dog watching, clapping like mad at home now. <laughs> They'll be getting the bit of, the bit of food, they'll grab. Let's see what was there anyway. Oh, it would have been four. The cat and the dog aren't clapping now, William. <laughs> anyway, you have £5,000. Give him a round of applause. Well done. Well done. Good move. All right, Maria. Here's your three. Aquarius. Yes. Aries. Yes. And Cancer. Aquarius, Aries, and Cancer. Are they children? 
Um, well, Michael's on my birth time. Ah, right. I'm one of yeah. the children. I think most of us do would pick, you know, ones that mean something to us. OK, there's your three coming up now. Now, which one to start, Aries, Cancer or Aquarius? Aquarius. Aquarius. And it's £1,000. <laughs> that is out. Aries or Cancer? Aries. Aries. £4,000. That's £5,000. <laughs> All right, Maria, you have 5,000. You choose now if you want to see what's behind cancer. You have five, you can stop. The risk factor here is losing one. But behind cancer, if it's a two or a three, then you'll get it. It's entirely up to yourself. The minimum you can get right now is four. Right. Um, I'll risk it. You'll risk it. All right, let's see what cancer has for you, Maria. And it's two, well risked. £7,000. Well £7,000. Excellent. All right, let's have a look at the summary board now. Let's move ourselves to our summary board, see who everybody's done so far this week. And there it is. Kay of £7,000, Lavinia, £8,000. Ali has two holidays and £6,000. William has £5,000. And Maria with £7,000. <laughs> now, let's find out who's going to play Fame and Fortune right here next week. Okay. Everybody's done very well this week. Let's see if we can get our five names out of the drum for next week. Anybody here send in any tickets for next week? Anybody do it? Yeah. Anybody over there? Just shout out your name. I'm only joking. Let's see who the first one is next week. Maureen Holbrook is going to be here from Bagnallstown in Carlow. Maureen, we'll see you next week. That's our first player for next week. Number two is Michael Fury, F-E-U-R-Y, Michael Fury, who comes from Lawrencetown in Banlalog in County Galway. See you next week. That's two. Third player is uh, Mary Comerford. Mary Comerford comes from Chatsworth Clock in Castlecomer. Castlecomer, that's where you're from. You'll be here. That's three. Fourth player on Fame and Fortune next week, and we're at our usual time next week, by the way. It's Maureen Barrett. Maureen lives in Earlsvale Place. Where is she? She's in Cavan. So you'll be here next week. <laughs> and one more. It's our fifth and final player on Fame and Fortune next week. And it's the man, it's Paul Tracy, who comes from Dysart in County Roscommon. We'll see you next week as well. That's our five. All right, now, let's move to the Fame and Fortune wheel. Now, here we are. Fame and fortune wheel. As you know, values here for each of our players to win, hopefully. Uh, three, four, and five thousand pounds. Holidays here worth at least three thousand uh, pounds to lovely locations that I know Ollie wants to go to, like Jamaica, like California, and maybe he'll leave a few for other people as well. But lots of holidays here. One person guaranteed a car, and of course, one person guaranteed to come with me, please God, to break the bank. So off we go, okay, in your own time. Three lights for a good spin, and the best of luck to you. Now, Kay, you just gave yourself £3,000. £3,000 for Kay. <laughs> now, Lavinia, you're up. <laughs> and, Kay, you may as well go on a holiday as well. <laughs> so, here you're, here's your destination, Kay. We're going to take you and a friend on a European tour of the beautiful Moselle Valley, Paris, Budapest, and romantic Venice, valued at three thousand pounds. Okay. Okay. <laughs> romantic Venice. Oh stop! Oh stop! <laughs> Be still, my beating heart, Kay. Will you go on that trip? I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm doing what I can for you here. I'm doing the best I can. Ollie, there's a few holidays left, I think. Okay. Let's see how we do. Off you go. And that's a red £3,000 for Maria. <laughs> You're up now, William, away you go. <laughs> and 
And while Maria's here, let's have a give her another five thousand pounds. <laughs> Maria, your turn to spin. You're okay. <laughs> You're there adding up the money, I know. I know. And that's five thousand pounds for William. Five thousand pounds for William. <laughs> Still got two people here. Okay, we're back to you. Just to give us another spin. We just keep going. The one person remains without a prize here. <laughs> William, Ollie is not pleased. <laughs> so you can maybe do a deal after the show. <laughs> You can decide which one. Lavinia, it's your turn to, to uh, spin again. All right. <laughs> hey, you're going on another holiday. <laughs> Let's see why you're not going this time, Kay. 